everyone. We're on our way to a tour to the PP Islands today. It's really early, like 8 a.m., but we're really excited. Are you excited, Logan? Excited. Okay, let's go. The driver was actually about 20 minutes late to pick us up, but we eventually got to the ferry and they provided us some snacks and like coffee and juice. So then we finally got on the boat and began our journey. It took about an hour to get to our first destination and all the views were great. We were really lucky because it actually wasn't even raining today, even though it was the rainy season. First we came to Viking Cove, which was called that because of one of the ships that's in there, so that was pretty cool to see. Instead of renting a long tail boat, we decided to just go swimming and Logan decided we should probably wear our life jackets. So Logan, do you like your camera holder? I love it. Oh. <laughs> Make sure to bring some sort of case to put your phone in so that you can get good footage underwater. There were even some fish that we saw, but here we didn't go scuba diving or anything. Then we made it to Kopi Pile, which has Maya Bay, and so we walked towards the bay. Okay, we just made it to Maya Bay, and we're gonna take some pictures together. As you can see, this place is really popular, so you'll definitely have to wait your turn to get a good view, but it's definitely possible to get some footage of you with no one in the background, and it's just so beautiful. And after that, we got some snacks, which for us was coconuts. Of course, they were so refreshing, and I saw a rooster too. <coughs> then we got back in the boat and headed towards Pipidon, which is where we had our buffet lunch. They had salad and other vegetarian options as well as halal options. And so there's Thai food, rice, and even some pasta. My personal favorite was the watermelon and the pad thai. Then we did some swimming nearby. And pro tip, if you don't wanna pay for the bathroom, use the ocean. It was really incredible to watch how they were able to squeeze a boat into literally one foot of space. Then it was finally time to go snorkeling. So this was really fun because we got to see some varieties of tropical fish as well as some coral reef formations. But they did warn us to be careful um, because it can be pretty sharp if you go down too far. Uh, so we ended up wearing our slippers, but you could also bring some water shoes that could be very helpful. And there were also lots of sea urchins, so definitely be careful not to um, touch anything too quickly. We stopped by Monkey Beach, which, as you can see, had no monkeys that day. But that's okay because we already went in Bali to see some monkeys. So we arrived at the last location which was Kai Island, so um, you're free to do some more swimming if you wanted to, or like buy some souvenirs uh, or some snacks. So we got some juice and just hung out by the beach until it was time to go home. Okay, so uh, we're wrapping up the tour today. We're just gonna chill out a little bit and then get back on the boat to go back. Did you have a fun time on the tour, Logan? More than that. All right, so we have another tour tomorrow, so make sure to stay tuned for that one.